South Korea is focusing on key science and industries that will drive growth for the country. The government identified 12 key strategic tech and will work with the private sector to turn them into growth engines. Om ji has the details. South Korea is gearing up to further boost its global technological dominance. President Yoon seok yeol announced plans for the country to invest more than 17 billion U.S. dollars over the next five years into developing its key strategic technologies. President Yoon chaired the inaugural meeting of the National Council on Science and Technology this Friday morning and welcomed scientists, researchers and officials from related ministries. In support of President Yoon's plan, the Minister of Science and ICT said that both the public and private sector should go all out to nurture the nation's core strategic technology because they serve as a major link between the country's economy and security. The council outlined 12 national strategic technologies that could be new growth engines for Asia's fourth largest economy. They range from the country's major economic driver, semiconductors, to secondary cell batteries, space technology and robots with the aim of being in the top five in the world in terms of technology. For semiconductors, South Korea is currently the world's biggest memory chip producer, but it plans to expand its global market share in system chips as well to 10 percent by 2030. The government aims to raise the country's exports of secondary cell batteries to $30 billion per year, which Seoul is already the world's top exporter of. The government also said that by 2027, the goal is to climb to third place from the current eighth in the IMB World Digital Competitiveness Ranking, which measures a nation's capability to adopt technology and create transformation. Also, in at least eight technologies, the country aims to get within 10 percent of the leading countries in terms of capability. Om Ji-young, Arirang News.